Hello, welcome to the Crafty Seas. I would just like to start today by saying a massive thank you to everyone who took the time to send me birthday messages, leave posts on social media and to send me some absolutely beautiful cards and gifts. I truly appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you so much. You made my birthday so special and I truly, truly appreciate it. So without further ado, I'm going to share with you some of the lovely crafty goodies that I received and beautiful cards. Firstly, we have this beautiful card from Christine Carpenter and she has made it with some gorgeous dried flowers and handmade paper, jemmies, it's all matte and layered and it says, let yourself bloom in creativity. Isn't that a lovely saying? And inside, she's put another strip of the matching card and it says, Dear Ashley, wishing you a very happy birthday on the 19th. I hope you have a fantastic day. Love, Christine. And thank you so much for the beautiful card. And you also kindly sent some ephemera in this beautiful personalised little wallet. Isn't that lovely with my name on it? Made me feel really special. It's stuffed to the gunnels of goodies. So I'll just share them with you. So we have some beautiful heart dies. And we also have this lovely dream catcher. And we are fans of dream catchers here at the Crafty Seas. And we have a few dream catcher dies and projects in mind, as well as some papers. So that will be perfect, Christine. And I'm not sure. I, I think you don't like dream catchers. You'll have to let us know in the comment section below. And if you're watching out there, do you like dream catchers or not? Let us know as well. A cute little fish. And we have a lovely arrow here. Some gorgeous ephemera. A beautiful little wax seal. Isn't that the cutest little thing you've seen? A cactus. Oh, that might come in handy for a project that we're working on. With some monsters on vacay. Ooh, stay tuned to see what we make with this. Perfect, thank you, Christine. And some gorgeous Christmas parcels. And look how unusual this is, this piece of vellum. It's amazing. A heart die cut and a lovely little piece of paper. And in, nestled in this side, we have even more goodies. And look at this beautiful little wax seal. Gorgeous. And some more bohemian themed toppers and die cuts. A Christmas. And look at this, a scrap. Gosh, this takes me back to my childhood. A beautiful angel scrap. And let us know in the comment section below if this is something that you remember from your childhood. As both myself and my mum Maureen used to collect stamps and had many happy hours cutting out the sheets and putting them in between book pages to keep them nice and flat. So thank you very much for that, Christine. It's a, a lovely trip down memory lane. Block and a little dress that could go over a stamp. A typewriter. A cute Volkswagen camper van. I'd love to have one of those in real life for little trips around the country. And a gorgeous butterfly. And last but not least, I absolutely love this, Christine. Happy crafting. Happy crafting! So thank you very much for that, Christine. They'll all come in handy in little projects. I love your little wallet you put it in, so thank you, Christine. And from one Christine to another Christine, this beautiful pink birthday card with the lovely balloons is from the very kind Christine Newton. And it says, wishing you a birthday full of surprises. And it says, happy 37th birthday to an amazing crafter and a great friend. Have a wonderful time on your birthday. Have a fantastic day. Lots of crafty hugs. Love, Christine Newton. And it's absolutely gorgeous inside as well with the balloons. Isn't that a beautiful card? So thank you very much, Christine. It was very nice to receive a card from you. And it certainly added a lovely surprise to my birthday. So thank you so much. And next up, I have this beautiful card and parcel with a seahorse sticker and wait to see this fancy card fold so this is the front with a beautiful mermaid mermaid image i wish i looked like that eh and the gorgeous 
Aurora Borealis Gems. This is my favourite style of gem. And it says, wishing you oceans of fun. And it opens up. And inside we have another beautiful image of a seahorse. And we have the lovely die cut mermaid and the stamped images. And then this section folds down to reveal your birthday message and another beautifully decorated panel with the Lavinia stamps and jemmies in the background. And it says, to Ashley, happy birthday, be a mermaid in a sea of fish. Hope you have a lovely day, love Andrea. And look at this beautiful stamping that she's put here with the mermaid on the rocks. Absolutely gorgeous and lovely shell patterned paper in the purples. And the card has been sitting on display like this on my mantelpiece. So thank you very much, Andrea. That's the first fancy fold card like that I've ever received and it was absolutely stunning. And you also very, very kindly sent me some birthday goodies, which is very much appreciated. And I'll just share them with you now. It was all lovely wrapped up, but my um, pet decided he quite liked the look of this wrapping paper as well, but I will try to salvage as much as I can. So I'll pop that off to the side and share with you the very kind birthday gift that Andrea has made and sent. So the first thing Andrea has included is this beautiful set of Kath Kidson hand creams. And if you've seen some of her recent Halloween crafting videos, my hands have been a little rough. So this is absolutely perfect, Andrea. Thank you so much. And I am a fan of hand cream, not that you would know. I often forget to put it on. So that is perfect and will be well loved and used. And next up is this pair of beautiful washi tapes in the lovely rose posy patterns. And you can never have enough washi tape in your stash, so thank you again. And then we have this absolutely beautiful handmade embellishment box. And it has the word inspire layered up here. And in the beautiful purples and greens in the nature theme. I absolutely love it. And inside it is packed with beautiful crafty goodness. We have some lovely pom-poms and my goodness, are these not the most delicate, cute little pieces you have ever seen? And they're all different. They're cakes and clouds and cupcakes. And I think that might even be a little tape. And some hearts and Battenberg cakes. Oh my goodness, these are fantastic. I have never seen anything like those. Amazing. I'm looking forward to crafting with them. And we have some brads in here, some flat back pearl embellishments and hearts, some beautiful iridescent seashell sequins. And we have some mermaid bits in our stash, so they will be perfect to craft along with them. And oh my goodness, we have the cutest. Let me just free them from captivity in this bag here. Do, do, do. You are free. Look at little Sammy the snail. Oh, he is beautiful. And there's some grass there for him to munch on. And some flowers. Oh, that is beautiful. Thank you so much, Andrea. And it keeps going. We have got some tags in here. And some beautiful bows. And these are all glittered. They say for you. Lovely. Handy for tucking in behind a little bit on a tag. And these, I think, might be buttons. I've never seen buttons like this. We have a penguin, a starfish, a flower, a skull and crossbow on an anchor, cherries, and the most delicate, beautiful bow. Wow, a gorgeous, gorgeous embellishment box there, Andrea. Lovely and lots of crafting fun. I've actually got a few projects in mind that these will be perfect for. So thank you. And matching, coordinating is this lovely folder that says dreams. Oh, isn't that beautiful? And inside, I love the, the colours, colourways you've chosen. 
We have a lovely bunny and some topper and journaling cards and some gardening themed ones. Absolutely beautiful. And this side is a lovely bird paper clip with some glittery foam. And that was holding in some journaling cards. And in here, on the other side, are some more all coordinating and all matching beautiful little journaling papers. And that's something that I would like to get into doing some more journaling. So these cards will be perfect for slotting into them. Absolutely lovely. And I love how it's all beautifully coordinated. It's going. You've been so kind, Andrea. I truly, truly appreciate it, everyone. And in here is a bird song metal die set. Wow, absolutely beautiful. And we've got the bird, the flowers, the dragonfly, and a lovely leaf. And that leaf is so versatile, that die. I can see myself using that in some autumn crafting I have planned. And apologies if you can hear any snuffling in the background. I have a very elderly dog who is digging a hole and puffing himself out at the moment. So apologies for the background noise. And here we have a beautiful stamp set. Feel better soon. Congratulations to someone special and sending special wishes. So really great sentiments. And I don't think I actually have a feel better soon sentiment in my stash. So great for all those get well soon cards. And also next up we have a cut and emboss folder. Now these are really fun because they emboss your card but also cut out an aperture. Um... We have a few in our stash, but we haven't actually used them yet. So this has given us the motivation to dig them out and perhaps make a video using them. So thank you once again, Andrea. So thoughtful. And wow, look at this. Like a stained glass penguin. I think that would be beautiful on some Christmas cards as well. So a huge thank you, Andrea. You have truly spoiled me. And I love absolutely everything that you have sent me. And it will be going to great use. I'll be having many hours happily crafting away with my nicely moisturised hands. So thank you. And next up, we have this beautiful purple and orange with the blending and the, I don't know if the camera's picking up, but it's got the subtlest iridescent sheen on it as well on the, the parts of the flower. And we've got these beautiful coordinating gems and it says, wishing you a special day. And this card's from the lovely Kim Kelly, who isn't on YouTube, but she does share her crafting over on Instagram. So I will leave her link as well as everyone I've mentioned in the description box below. So please pop over and show them some crafty love, as they are all very lovely crafters. And the envelope came decorated in beautiful stickers. And inside, Kim kindly popped these gorgeous pastel stickers. And he's fabulous. So they come in the beautiful shades and they're all different sentiments. Yay for today, shine bright, happy birthday, party time, cute little rainbows, handmade with love. So perfect for sticking onto your envelopes or the inside of a card or a small ATC. And here is another sheet, completely different uh, designs of brighter ones. Again, the future is bright, happy birthday, someone special. You've got this. Yay! So thank you very much for that, Kim. I absolutely love the colours that you've used in your card and certainly will be using those stickers. Next up is this beautiful parcel and card. And look how fancy this card is. It stands up like that. And look at all the gold matte and layering and dimension on it. It's absolutely stunning. Very, very pretty. And this card is from the lovely Monica. And it says, Dear Ashley, happy birthday. Hope you will have a fantastic time. Best wishes, Monica. Thank you so much, Monica. Your card and gift certainly contributed to me, to me having a beautiful birthday. I really appreciate you taking the time to make and send me something. It's so nice to have some handmade cards on the mantelpiece and cards from fellow crafters and new friends. So thank you very much, everyone. And Monica is also known as Paper Mona on youtube so if you're not subscribed please pop over where she gives you fantastic tutorials on how to make cards like this on her channel 
So let's dive in. And it's all beautifully arrived in a decorated box with this tissue. And inside, oh my goodness, it's packed with goodies. We have these beautiful fabric flowers. Look how delicate they are. And there's one in the pink. A beautiful peachy shade. They're so soft and delicate. And oh, I love the mint green. Isn't that stunning with the, the peachy shades? They're so pretty. And a blue one. Now, I'm not sure. I know Monica does. She li likes to make flowers and uh, she's used the flower forming foam and made tutorials in the past. So I'm not sure if these are actually made by yourself, Monica. You can let us know, but they're so stunning. And thank you for sending them to me. And we have a lovely aeroplane stamp in here. And we don't have anything like this all aboard. In part in a collaboration, Monsters on Vacay. I'll leave the link to that down below. And this will be absolutely perfect for some of our monsters to hop on board. So thank you very much, Monica. And a bit of bling. Who doesn't like a bit of bling? And these are fantastic in reds, yellows and greens. Oh, and it's got blues and purples on the back. So perfect for all projects. And they're a great small size. And these ones are actually self-adhesive as well. So perfect for just popping onto a project. And ooh, yummy. An intensive dark chocolate. Green and black's organic. Oh, you're truly spoiling me here, Monica. This is also known as crafting fuel for anyone out there that doesn't know. Chocolate is the official crafting fuel. And it's intense dark. Now, because it's intensely dark, it'll be a little bit bitter for my palette. So that will be limiting to me to just one little square at a time. But I'm sure I'll manage to devour the whole block anyway. Thank you so much, Monica. And next up, oh my goodness, we have... I'll show you these lovely die cuts first. I don't think I've seen these die cuts these might be the ones, the pre-die cuts from Crafter's Companion that um, they've just launched. Because they're so, so thick. You can let us know, Monica. I'm, I'm pretty sure they are. I've seen them on a... I'm sure they're the ones I've seen you shown in the video. And you made some beautiful cards with them. Well, it's really interesting to see them in the flesh. And perfect for card toppers. Absolutely perfect. And I love this little cute frame. I think this one might be getting inked up black for Halloween as the season. And a lovely geometric design one that almost looks like laser thin cut wood. Fantastic. Really looking forward to using them and something different. And you've been super kind, Monica. Look at all this paper. Cannot believe this. Wow. Wow, and it feels really, really good quality paper. Beautiful. And they're all double-sided. Wow. Wowzer. I'll just give you a click, a quick flick through of these beautiful papers. Now, I think these might be craft o'clock papers, as Monica was a design team member for them. But I'm not sure. I haven't seen anything like those. Beautiful, beautiful colours. Wow, so many different designs and oh, this kind of grungy one. Again, I'm in full Halloween mode, so my brain is ticking. Oh, I love the green. Absolutely gorgeous. And again, all double-sided. So great. I, I, I'm a fan of double-sided paper. And they're such a good weight as well. So perfect for any project. And I see they come in all different colours and designs and really unusual look at this wood grain one perfect for a garden shed project that is on our to-do list we have a gardening card to make postal and again all double-sided oh i'm going to have to take my time and look at these properly oh wow absolutely stunning really fantastic beautiful Thank you ever so much, Monica. I truly appreciate you taking the time out of your busy schedule to think of me on my birthday, make me such a beautiful card and send me all these goodies. 
I feel so truly grateful. Thank you so much. And I'll just pop this off to one side. The full card is from the lovely Lorna Callahan. And isn't this a super fancy card? It's acetate. And you see you've got the lady standing here. It says happy birthday to you. Live, li live the life you love. And it's got a thistle. And this is the nice nature leaf gold acetate. You have the beautiful ribbon here. And a Scottish thistle hiding in this image. And it says you've got this. And this is one of Dawn shiny silver treasures paper from the vintage treasures collection i think uh, i love that paper it was absolutely beautiful so it's a gorgeous gorgeous card and inside it says to ashley happy birthday have a great day crafty hugs lorna thank you so much lorna receiving the cards from everyone and the gifts really did make my day a great one so thank you so much and Wow, you have been super kind and generous and truly spoiled me. And I loved how everything was all wrapped up in this beautiful wrapping paper and all co coordinated. It's just such a special touch. And Lorna has kindly sent me loads of these pocket letters. Now, we didn't have any of these in our stash. Um, and it's we've received a few loaded pocket letters letters from Lorna and from Kim Kelly as well and we couldn't participate in the swap back with Kim at the time because we didn't have any of these envelope holders so Lorna has kindly gifted me <laughs> look how many is here absolutely tons uh, so we'll be making a lot of pocket letters uh, so stay tuned to see us making them we just recently made our very first ever pocket letter so these will be put to great use and I cannot wait to be making pocket letters with them. Thank you very much. And I gently try to open the wrapping here. I wanted to keep it in the parcels just to show you how beautifully it was all presented. And I will show you the goodies. So first up we've got this super cute pocket sticker book now look how cute these animals are on the front with their eyes aren't they so sweet and you've got all different animals in here owls raccoons oh they're so sweet they would be perfect maybe in some autumn crafting as well and some cute cutesy animals on the back oh a koala i know someone who would like that sticker so i'll keep that to the side to put on some happy mail in future fabulous thank you Lorna and wow the fall collection autumn stickers these from the range oh I feel a trip to the range coming on to check these goodies out autumn stickers lovely I'll not open them up on camera just now I'll have a good look later oh gorgeous dried flowers wow Look at them. Aren't they absolutely magnificent? And yellows and... Oh, I'm really looking forward to crafting with them. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. And, ah, stickers. Are these the stickers that you have been using, Lorna? I know you got a sticker book recently and it's been... Yeah, I think this might be the stickers. They've been fantastic. Lorna's been using them in a lot of her projects and they're fabulous. Oh, thank you so much. These are going to be great. Lovely, all different sizes and colours. Look at all these. The, yeah, this is the sticker book, I'm sure. You can you can let me know in the comment section below. Oh, these are going to be so handy for ATCs and cards. This is a paper hug. Oh, they're great. Absolutely, perfectly imperfect. Enjoy, enjoy, enjoy. La Via Belle. La Via Belle, life is good. Oh, these are fantastic. Oh, wow. I'm really looking forward to... Yeah, these are the stickers because this is the sticker that was on the, the card. Lorna's been crafting up a storm with these stickers, so I've got plenty of inspiration over on her channel on how to use these stickers as well. 
Fantastic. Gosh, this... Oh, Halloween ones. Amazing. And some beautiful Christmas ones. Oh, I'm so excited. Thank you, thank you. Okay, this is going to be a super long video, so I'm trying to whiz through things, and I will go in back and look at them in more detail and enjoy them. I hope you've all grabbed a cup of tea for this. And in here... Wow! Alice in Wonder themed embellishment box. I'm just, just open it up and it is jam packed with goodies. Oh, we have to start. Look at these. Oh, wow. How shiny they are. They would be amazing in a shaker. Oh, I love them. And they're in all different shades. Can you see? Yep. Wow. And these little iridescent cup flower ones. You could put a bead in them and sew them onto a project. Oh, look how cute these split pins are. They're fabric covered. Wow. I've never seen anything like this. Check. Gingham. And a little daisy. Wow. Oh, wow. Never seen anything like this. Thank you so much. And some metal ones. Oh, I love them. Oh, I could see a project. Something Halloween-esque. Or mixed media with them. Oh, I love them. Absolutely love them. Thank you, Lorna. And some resin or ceramic uh, roses. Aren't they pretty? I've got a project in mind that these would be perfect for as well. Oh, gosh, this is fantastic. And some pearl embellishments that's beautiful look at the bling on that and some but <laughs> some buttons i think i'm not sure if these are how these buttons have been made and you can let me know lorna i'm not sure if they're paper or la i'm not really sure they're fantastic and oh look how cute look how delicate and cute these little flowers are love them and they're all in different shades of blue you're so sweet absolutely gorgeous i love an embellishment box such a fun way to gift crafty goodies thank you so much lorna and then oh gosh you've really spoiled me look at this beautiful paper <laughs> and da -da -da -da. then we have oh all good things are wild and free. I agree. Look at this beautiful paper pad. Oh, stunning. Oh, and they're all double-sided. And beautiful shades of green and brown. Oh, I love it. I really, really love it. Look at this with all the sentiments. Enjoy your gift. Nothing but a dreamer. And they're all coordinated with the papers. Weirdest brother ever. <laughs> I want I want to run away. Cocktail time. Let's go travelling. And thank you so much. Thank you so much, Lorna. I absolutely love it. Wow. It's a really good GSM as well. Does it say 250? You could even make boxes with this. It's so... Oh, wow. I hope, the, I hope I'm getting it on screen. It's a massive paper pad. So I'll give you a quick flick through on camera and then I will look at it in more detail. Isn't that stunning? It reminds me almost of William Morris style. Oh, I love it. Wow. And then you've got the kind of Toile de Jouy style with the trees. Wow. And oh, look at that shade of green. I absolutely love it. Beautiful, and it repeats as well, so you get multiples of the designs, because we all make mistakes. Well, I certainly make mistakes when I'm cutting card bases and mats and layers, so it's always handy to have more than one sheet. Thank you so much, Lorna. I love everything. I love the colours and everything that you've picked out for me and made for me. It's just perfect. Thank you ever so much. And a huge thank you to everyone who watches the channel and everyone who sent birthday wishes you truly made my day 
feel so, so special. And I'm truly thankful to each and every one of you from the bottom of my heart. So thank you, Lorna. Thank you so much, Andrea. Thank you so much, Monica. Thank you, Kim. It's beautiful. Thank you, Christine. And thank you, Christine. And thank you all at home for watching. You can drop me a comment below letting me know how you celebrate your birthday. And until next time, thanks ever so much for watching. Happy crafting!